All right, so I have here a drain cleaner by Vivor. I received this in exchange for a review, but all of these thoughts are my own. There was a little bit of assembly required. I had to put the wheels on and also this bar at the top, but that was super easy to install. And you'll almost definitely want to put those on right away because this thing is quite heavy and that'll make it a lot easier to move around. So it'll plug into a three prong extension cord. When you use it, you'll need to push the reset button. That'll turn on that red light right there. It's kind of dim, but it's definitely on now. Comes with these various accessories and you'll install one at the head of the cable. Each one obviously has a different function in terms of cleaning your drain, used for various purposes. I'm gonna install this one for now and they're just on this very simple keychain. Just gonna unclasp it, take off the one that you want and close that up again. To change this head, you're gonna take off that screw. Slip the new head between those two steel brackets. And then put the screw back in. All right, so now it's all ready to use. You do wanna make sure to wear good gloves when you use this thing. Not only will that keep your hands a little neater because it will get a bit messy, but also you wanna keep your hands safe. That cable is strong and you definitely don't wanna tear your hands up, so wear some good gloves. Here's the indicator indicating which way it's going, so you wanna turn this to forward, just like that. I'm gonna clean out this drain right here. And I'm probably not gonna go too far just because this drain has not been giving me any problems, but I just kinda wanna demonstrate this machine. We're gonna start by just feeding about a foot into the hole. Then you're gonna rotate it by actually putting your foot on this button here. And it kind of feeds itself in. It finds its way around the curve or depending on the head you have on it, uh, even down the straight line. So then you're just gonna feed it in, let it keep on going. It'll find its way through. I don't like pulling out too much at a time because then I find that it kind of buckles on you a little bit. Rather than going in, it kind of gets tangled right here. So I like to pull it out as it's using it. Give it just a little bit of pressure as it goes in. That way it doesn't buckle up and try to come back out. But that's my experience. Seems to be working so far. So we're gonna turn it on reverse. Just like that. You don't want to hold it on reverse the whole time it's coming out because then you might hurt yourself when that attachment comes out. But push the button in reverse a little bit. That way it'll get unstuck from whatever it's stuck on. Then you can start pulling it out. And even though my drain is pretty clear, you can definitely tell it's a little dirty down there. This drain cleaner definitely feels well built. It's strong. It's powerful. Be careful with it. Don't hurt yourself. But I do recommend it. If you'd like to purchase it, there's a link in the description. We get a small commission and it would really help us out. I'm Chris and with my wife Abby's help, I'm on a quest to review literally everything sold on Amazon. So if there's something that you need a review of, literally just tell me, let me know in a comment and I'll literally buy it and just review it for you, literally. They tell me that I'm never